Hello. Today we look at cards for the 23rd and the 24th of March, 2021, and they are all major arcana, the Wheel of Fortune, the Lovers Reversed, and the World Reversed, growing apart, or the way we were. This is my least favorite spread so far this year. All major arcana, just in case we miss the point, or miss a chance to put things right. As daunting as these cards are, at least at present, both the Wheel of Fortune and the world never cease to turn, which is as encouraging of a message as we're going to get today. I'm glad to have an opportunity to acknowledge the devil again, as he made quite the impression in the last spread. If you place the devil beside the lovers, using the olden time or traditional tarot, you'll notice a relationship. The nude lovers on the lovers card, number six of the major arcana, look very much like the two nude humans chained up in dog collars to the devil's podium on the devil's card. An angel hovers over the lovers on the lovers card, while the devil hovers over the lovers on the devil card. A lot of hovering over lovers. Number 15 of the major arcana, number 15 is one plus five is six. In the Kabbalistic Tarot, it is explained that Satan is a Hebrew word for the opposing force devised by the Creator to test creation, and refers to Satan simply as the opposer. We could not have more opposition in the cards today if we tried. However, the message may also be that should we want a relationship to succeed or a relationship at all, we have to try a hell of a lot harder. A card that is bittersweet to see in the past position is the Wheel of Fortune in the upright, Number 10 of the Major Arcana, and everything was going our way. In this position, it may certainly seem that the good times are all behind us. The couple riding high and living the good life in the past now seem delegated to the past. We feel like we've had our turn. Jupiter and Sagittarius rule this card of expansion and good luck. In this position, depending on your own astrological DNA, you may have even been born lucky or with a fortunate life path in general, destined for success. The past mood compared to the present and future is a stark and jarring contrast. The Lovers in the Upright talks about harmonious relationships and, of course, love and attraction. Gemini, the twins, rules this card of duality and what they call twin flames. It is a romantic concept, and this should be a romantic card. Six is perfect. Karmic balance. In the reverse, we have opposition. Without Satan, according to the Kabbalistic Tarot, there would be no free will. The Lovers, often referred to as the choice in the reverse, is not making one. The world, number 21 of the major arcana, in the upright is a card of completion, wholeness, and also a card of harmony. In the upright, these lovers would be in tune with each other. These cards are so strong, and in the upright would be such an epic love story, it's tragic to see this much opposition. The world, so it seems, is against these lovers, and it is a shame to let the world keep you apart for whatever reason, status, race, religion, distance. But the tarot being the tarot, there are other potential meanings. Of course, the lockdowns and travel bans are keeping people apart, and hopefully this is all this is, but with all major arcana, we need to pay attention. The lover's reversed represents communicable diseases, so these cards are suggesting that up until now, you've been lucky if you haven't had one, in which case these cards would read as a strong warning. Incomplete. These two people in the past position, the king and a queen, celebrating their good fortune at the top of the wheel, are, as they say, two peas in a pod. While this spread can be saying the relationship is over, the world and the reverse can also be saying it isn't. Someone may mean the world to you, or you may feel as if someone is your world, or you may be theirs. The world is the card of completion, and without this twin flame, you or they may feel the lack of their better half. A breakup or divorce or the loss of a dear lover or friend may turn your own world upside down. These cards suggest that this relationship is worth the risk. The Wheel of Fortune is a gambler's card. We may be in danger of denying our destiny. We may also be in denial of a relationship having had its day and need to let go. There is altitude in the cards, or was. The Dancer on the World card quietly and gracefully turns on her toes in space, but in the reverse, this can mean anything falling to earth from space. The lovers in the reverse can be a hybrid. Maybe you're both hybrids. Lucky you.